Hello, Gemini. Welcome to your February 2024 mid-month check-in. These are intended to be brief. This is just a new addition to my lineup. Every birthday baby, and there are two per month, will have a full-length video. These, for the rest of you, uh, at this point anyway, are just brief energy check-ins. So let's see what spirit has for you, Gemini. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. This can also be the energy of somebody you are connected to. So let's get some overarching energies for you, Gemini. Sky Dancers, Surrender. Okay, we have Hollow Bone, Teachability. Wow. Eye of the Needle, Intentionality, Repairing the Veil, Forgiveness. Whoa, Gemini, what have you been through? My goodness. It feels like you are wrapping up uh, a cycle, something that's been fairly painful. And it feels like the way forward has everything to do with the intention you set, whether, you know, for yourself in a relationship, I feel like you could slip backward. You could, I just saw one, two, three, <laughs> move forward and progress in a new direction. Because I feel like once, once you stitch this up, once you've learned what you needed to learn, then it's, okay, what do I want to do now? I don't want to repeat it. I'm hearing that very loudly. I don't want to repeat it. Okay, Gemini, let's see what Spirit has to say about what this is for you. What do you need to know, Gemini? walk in their shoes. Taurus had that. Okay, let's see what we've got here. Sacrifice. What are you willing to do to change your circumstances for the better? Moving countries. Lighten your load. You're moving your life to a new country or continent. Woo, Gemini. I don't know that I've seen that in the general reading, so my, this could be specific coming back around. The past is not done. There's a reason you're revisiting this. I feel like this could be the start of, you know, perhaps a new relationship, a new life. If someone's coming back into your life, this could be an opportunity to forgive and move forward. And, and I feel like the, the mm, I don't want to call it a caveat, but I'm going to, because that's the only word that I'm thinking of. The, the, the disclaimer or the caveat to this is make sure that you're coming to this with a new energy. Because I think once you have, you know, done some repairs and, and you've healed from a situation, you don't want to go back. Like this is a tough lesson, right? It's a tough lesson. Okay. Gemini, let's see what needs to come through for you. Ooh, high priestess. Trust your intuition. Trust what you feel. It won't lead you astray. All right, Gemini, what do you need to know? <laughs> the cards are flying off the top of the deck. I'll take it. We have the Page of Cups, the Page of Pentacles in reverse. The Hierophant, the world, wow, look at that, moving countries. You're definitely on the move. You're on the move, Gemini. We have the Knight of Cups, the Three of Pentacles, the Seven of Wands, Seven of Cups. Ooh, I, I feel like there could be something that presents itself that looks really good. And you may be super tempted to say, Ooh, yeah, this, this looks great, but I need to make sure I'm making the right choice. And I think this is based on experience because maybe they haven't been, um, you know, good choices in the past. You could be manifesting a connection coming back together. Could be, um, wow. So we, we have the page of cups. Are you 
messaging someone? Are they messaging you? Is this like an apology, an icebreaker? The Page of Pentacles in Reverse. I think there's a little bit of... Um, resentment that there's something that I feel lingers over whatever this is and and whatever that is it has to get corrected we're gonna look into that we'll clarify these Hierophant you may be um, looking at something related to um, the 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 blending of two cultures with this world energy moving countries it's like can I assimilate is this good will it work am I you know am I going to I, I I'm I'm just kind of getting a um, am I am I going into something that is like set up for for success and I think it that this is asking you to really be mindful of what you've learned so far. Now, for some of you, what's happening is you're kind of shifting your environment and that shift is bringing you something that may look similar to your past. I don't know why I'm getting that. It's almost like brand new opportunity, like Okay, I'm, I just got a download. I can go here, I can do there, but I'm still me and I'm still um, the, the product of my experiences. What am I gonna do differently? Ooh. Okay, that might have hit home for somebody. Let's look at the Page of Cups. Gemini, Page of Cups, Ace of Cups. A loving message, we have strength. One more. Somebody might want to reach out and say, listen, you know, can we try again? This could be someone you meet. You know, this could be a message online maybe and someone's like, mm, you know, and, and maybe you're at a distance from someone is what I met. Some of you it could be like an online dating situation. Um, but I'm kind of getting that someone's reaching out like kind of tail between the legs. Can I do this again? Am I willing to go there again? Can I dust this off? Have I been wounded beyond repair? Has our relationship been wounded beyond repair? Page of Pentacles in reverse. King of Cups reverse. I was getting resentment. There could have been a perception of emotional manipulation. Even immaturity. I don't know why I'm getting that. But it's like, okay, wait a minute. <laughs> we can make this what we want to make this. So let's take the high road. Let's look at the Hierophant. Hierophant, please. The King of Pentacles. Strong Earth energy with this. Taurian energy. Hierophant, King of Pentacles. Judgment. With the moon at the bottom of the deck. Okay. Um, I think that there is a level of discernment coming through for me with this. It's like, okay, um, whatever I'm about to do, it's a pretty big decision. I want to make sure that I'm that I'm doing this um, not only with the right intentions, of course, but what am I? What am I bringing to this? What am I stepping into? Let's get one more. Hierophant, King of Pentacles, Judgment. It can be a big decision about a commitment, long-term, you know, plans. I mean, certainly if you're moving countries and, and moving countries to be with someone, uh, that's a pretty big step. It shows the intention that you want to fix this. Holy wow. The Wheel of Fortune. A cycle has ended, so a new one can begin. This could be a very fortunate turn of events. I, I feel like this is fate stepping in. Let's look at the world. I do get a travel energy with this. Wow. Something's done. And 
Gemini, you might need to look at a situation that was really painful as something that uh, presented itself at a point in time. And now, you know, you can do with it what you want. Again, remember, I was like, okay, do I, tr do I trust myself? Can I do this again or am I going to get hurt? But nothing ventured, nothing gained. What are you willing to do? So wrap up the old, heal the old. It's done. Chariot. If we get the world, I'm thinking this is definitely world travel. Chariot, please. The Knight of Swords in reverse. Hmm. Um, I think it's related to whatever was difficult and whatever ended. And it, there's a reckless and angry energy to this Knight of Swords in reverse. And I, I feel like, you know, it's whatever's going to happen is all in your approach. It could even be that um, there is a trip. Okay, I'm getting there could be a trip to visit someone and and like you're already on you're already anticipating it may not go well. Let's let's get another one on the chariot. Knight of Pentacles. We have a few knights. We have a few pages. Interesting. I feel like it, this is about your intention. It's this is methodical progress. Like, okay, spirit is saying, what is the chariot? Got it. <laughs> it's immobilized right now. And we have, you know, the two sphinxes pointing in opposite directions. So you could do this, you could do this. Is this your approach, Gemini? Whoa, <laughs> this stack fell out, wow. Um, but, but they wanted me to look at the hermit. You've been here before, you've done this before, you're wiser now, learn the lesson, and it, it's really about not repeating the, the the past pattern bottom of the deck was the seven of cups by the way if you didn't see that it feels like okay it's I, I'm almost hearing like it's up to me what what this becomes or what I do next is all about me so be very careful of your approach of another person's approach and you know you can you can um you know, make it what you're going to make it. I, I can't tell if this is a reconciliation. It's definitely not done. So if this is a lesson that you've needed to learn so that you don't repeat it, um, duly noted, right? Nobody wants to. <laughs> I think we all want to just learn. We want to learn and evolve. Gemini, your hard work is paying off. Yay. A personal issue reaches resolution. Confidence is your key to success. Is it this one? Yes. The answers you need are coming. And Gemini, let's finish up with some guidance and timing, perhaps, if that's appropriate spirit. What do you have for Gemini? Okay, there's something happening that you didn't see. You might have been blindsided by someone or something. Something may be happening behind the scenes and you're like, whoa, I never saw that coming. Okay, um, or it could be in reverse. Okay, March may be significant for Gemini and whatever's going on with you. What else? Your person is heaven sent. But of course, <laughs> Gemini, I've remarked in past videos, you get this, this kind of, you know, strong soulmate twin flame vibe in, in many of your readings, more so than other signs. Okay, wow, we have time to move on. So this could be, um, you know, a change of scenery. It doesn't have to be leaving a relationship. It's whatever is going on in your life that you're like, you know what? I, yep, I'm done with that chapter, that phase, that behavior, that pattern, that limitation, whatever that is for you. I'm ready to move forward. Focused on work and money. 
Okay. This can be focused on work. This can be working on your stability. Um, it, it can be related to rebuilding in some way. Okay, Jim, I'm not going to overthink it. I'm going to leave it there. That's your quickie check-in. Thanks for being here. I'll see you in the next video. Take care.